hey guys, if you're wanting to lower your uh, Porsche 944 for free, um, you can get a total of an inch drop on your rear torsion for free, basically, by adjusting these uh, two bolts on the torsion bar arm here. And um, an easy way to do it is that you don't really need a lift, but it helps. And we use also a jack to put um, pressure up onto the upward pressure up on the uh, rear suspension. But basically what you'll do is you will loosen this pivot bolt right here, loosen it all the way so it'll move. And you'll loosen this eccentric bolt here. And um, if I show you in here, you can see the head of the bolt inside there, which is this big, big bolt right here. And you'll see the uh, the shaft is actually eccentric, so it's offset. Here's the center line of the head of the bolt. Here's the center line of uh, where the nut is. And so basically you wanna move this whole assembly, this whole bolt will move. Um, and what you'll do is you'll loosen both of these, push up on the suspension. So you could do this with the car on the ground, as long as you have these two bolts loose. Um, you'll put upward pressure on the suspension and um, get this whole, this pin or this bolt to rotate. And you might have to beat it uh, with a hammer um, to get this whole assembly loose because they, um, at, as the car ages, um, these plates will rust together and this pin will actually rust inside there too. But once you have that broke loose, as you can see, there's the old line right there where it was and it'll drop down and that's what it'll give you your drop. And so once it's all the way um, maxed out, uh, tighten this bolt first, the pivot one, and then tighten this one and you'll be set. And we'll show you what it looks like here at the end, but here's the, uh, uh, we'll show the old gap first and then I'll show you the, um, the new wheel gap afterwards, but yeah.